So just finished lunch. Jay's up there doing some stuff on uh, Derek's cutter. And I'm about to grease. We've already loaded 11 today already uh, by lunch time here. Red. There was red. I like it. I got uh, the 70, pick, 70 piece bit set from uh, Milwaukee also too in that last group that I got. We're going to put a battery on the uh, grease gun here. And that's what we're All right, we're about to get this party started. I've got the machine lifted up to get the rock guards off on the inside and outside to do what we're going to do down there, but I'm going to go ahead and uh, fill her up with fuel, pump fuel in it right quick here. So y'all hold tight just a second. All right, folks, here we go. We're going to run two different sockets here in this situation. We're going to run a straight one. It's got, well, let me show you here. So it's got two bolts, one up and one low, low and up low. And then the bottom bolt, we're going to have to get it with a wobble. I'm going to do the top bolt with a straight and the bottom ones with a wobble. You can see what we're going to do here. The, this back roller, is complete, the bolts are completely out of it right there on both sides. We're going to, uh, we've got to drop the rock guards which run from here, the half right there on the outside which is where we're at now and on the inside too to get the bolts out. Where we can run a tap up in them holes and clean them holes there, make sure they're good and clean. And uh, first thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna jump back up here and I'm gonna pick it back up in the air when I get it up. And then we're gonna get the party started with the high torque impact right there. This is where it's seen that is right there. Right there. The reason Jay's not over here yet, he's over there working on the 635. That's right out of the camera screen right there. He's working on doing a couple things here. I'm going to go ahead and get this going there.
let y'all watch the whole thing right here. Y'all, a lot of y'all like this stuff like yeah, this. It's actually pretty cool. I take it for granted because I see this junk every day. this thing. You can see it. You see how it lights it up up in there? Let's see. Y'all probably can't see it. There, you can probably see that better right there. You lose a lot of your torque. You got it with that one, Y'all see the roller fill out. 
<laughs> We're gonna fix it today. Y'all bear with us. <laughs> so we ran out of stuff. We didn't have the tap that we needed to tap those holes out. The bolts were, they were kind of okay, but the holes where they went up through the frame right there, they were messed up just a little bit. So got my sister going to send her on a wild goose chase in the morning to uh, run us down a, a metric tap. Um, it was an M18, two and a half pitch I believe is what it was on them so we'll, what we did was I just left the roller out and left the rock guards off for right now so y'all actually get a second part of this video when I go to put it back together uh, a lot of stuff that we worked on the uh, last couple days a lot of it I was not able to film because just because I was in the loader loading while it was all being done so uh, we had several things to do at 635 we had a uh, after cooler boot, I believe that's what it was. It done got a slight hole in it. It was whistling a little bit. Jay fixed it today. Did several other things on the 635 too. Did several things on Derek's machine. I'm not sure what all what all it was. I was just hammering it, trying to hammer trucks out of there as quick as I could and uh, get that done. But uh, you can see the uh, the high torque impact. It was pretty impressive. Just had trouble on that one it, uh, with the wobble on it. Of course, a wobble, anybody that's used a wobble, boy, you lose a lot of torque with a wobble socket. So when I went over there and I got the uh, the regular socket, it, it popped it right out. But y'all gonna get to see a lot more Milwaukee stuff. Talked, they emailed, we talked back and forth today with the M son today. And so very cool, very cool deal. So, um, Please subscribe to me if you would. I'd appreciate that. Thanksgiving's coming right up around the corner. All the clickable stuff's right down below. If you go to my to my website now, if you want some shirts, I have marked the tan shirts down, and they're seventeen dollars. Uh, there was nineteen. I've marked them down to seventeen, and also the original. I've got some large and extra large left of the original. I think I marked them down to 13. They were 15. I marked them down to 13. Uh, any order 
that is over $50, uh, I will include a sticker in there with it too uh, when, when it ships. So, you know, not too bad. So that's going to start, that's actually like that now. So if you want some of that stuff, go get it. Got tons of stuff on there. I don't have the beanies in my hands yet. I called in last week and checked on them and they said they should have them any day. So I'm going to let y'all go for right now. We'll catch y'all later. Later, taters.